This is the story of Princess Elsa and Princess Anna. When they were little girls, they were best friends. Princess Anna was one of the only people in the world that knew Princess Elsa's secret. Elsa had the special power to make snow and ice. One night, Elsa used her secret power and filled the grand ballroom with snow so the sisters could play. As they were playing, Elsa lost control and she accidentally hit Anna with a blast of icy magic. Anna was badly hurt. Her parents went off to the ancient mountain troll to ask them for help. The wisest old troll told them that Anna could be saved and that she was lucky to have been hit in the head and not in her heart. As the years passed, Anna forgot about that night. To keep Elsa's special gift a secret from everyone else, their parents surrounded the castle with walls and never let anyone inside. It seemed whenever Elsa had strong feelings, her magic powers would spill out. Elsa never wanted to hurt her sister again, so she stopped playing with Anna. Anna became very lonely. Even after their parents were lost, the two sisters didn't spend any time playing together. Years later, it was time for Elsa to become queen. For just that one special day, the castle gates were opened. Hundreds of guests attended Elsa's coronation ceremony. Elsa worked very hard the whole day to hide her feelings and special powers. At the party, Anna danced with a handsome prince. He made her heart flutter. They fell in love and decided to marry. Elsa thought this engagement was a bad idea. Anna could not believe her sister, and they started arguing. As Elsa lost control, and started to shout, her secret power was exposed. As ice shot from her hands, everyone stared in shock. Now they all knew her secret. Elsa ran out of the castle and fled to the mountains. It was summer, but Elsa's power had created a terrible winter storm. Anna felt terrible and ran off to find her sister. Despite the bad winter storm, she met a magic snowman along the way named Olav. Olav knew where they would find Elsa and agreed to help. Olav led Anna to a beautiful ice palace that Elsa had created with her powers. Inside, Anna found Elsa and told her about the terrible storm. Anna told Elsa she must come back and help, but Elsa did not want to hurt anyone and they started fighting about her return. As they fought, a wave of magic burst from Elsa and struck Anna in the heart. Elsa knew what she had to do. She had to find the trolls and ask how to reverse the magic which was now freezing her sister. Olaf agreed to help. Elsa and Olaf found the ancient mountain troll and he said, only an act of true love can thaw Anna's frozen heart. Elsa brought Anna back to their parents' castle to find the prince Anna was to marry, as he could save Anna with his true love. He laughed when he saw her and threw the sisters in the dungeon. I only pretended to love her to get the castle and kingdom, said the prince. Afraid and locked in the dungeon, Elsa looked at her frozen sister. All of a sudden, the prince came in with a sword. He swung it at Anna, and the sword shattered on her frozen body. Elsa grabbed her and held her frozen sister tight. And suddenly, Anna began to thaw. As Olaf watched them, he remembered the wise old troll and what he said. An act of true love will thaw her frozen heart. The two sisters' love had saved them and their kingdom. 
they were best friends again. Even in the summer, Elsa always made Olaf snow so he could never melt. And now the castle gates were wide open. The evil prince was long gone, and they all lived happily ever after. <laughs>